how to set up your we here smart key drop lock i'm going to go through everything to get it set up on the app without the app get it all working and everything like that we're going to need our smart lock we're going to need the keys uh, to get it started we are going to need two double a batteries if you need those i'll put a link down below uh, anyways uh, so we're going to start by putting batteries in our lock so we're going to remove this cover here two double a batteries insert these two double a batteries We'll hear that little beep. It's turning on. So now the next thing we're going to want to do, pop that cover on, make sure it clicks tight. And the next thing you may want to do is mount it to the wall. So to mount it to the wall, you can go ahead and use the key to open it and open the door. And then it comes with the screws and everything you need to mount. You need to have it open in order to mount it to the wall or whatever you are trying to mount it to. The next thing you're going to want to do is get it paired up to the app. So we're going to, you're going to want to find this Wii here app right here and go ahead and open it it's going to have you create an account and everything like that once we do that we're just going to come up here to this plus sign because we're going to add this lock so it says scan the QR code on the lock so I'm going to go ahead and do that it's, it's starting to scan so what I'm going to do is I'm going to find actually on the inside of the lock on the inside door of the lock I'm going to find this QR code in here and I'm going to go ahead and scan it I can go ahead and give this device a name, house, and add it. Add success. Great. Now, I'll show you what I can do now. So now it's going to connect, and I'll show you right now. See, right now it's locked, and now I can open it straight from the app. So then from here, I can control all of the access and I can do it in a number of different ways. One, I can create different passwords. So I can create a one-use a one -use password to give to somebody. I can create a static password, which is more like just basically like a normal password. Every time you use it, it will open it. And I can set a timed password that will only work for a certain period of time. I can also create this uh, this what they call it a, uh, uh, a dynamic password which changes every 60 seconds so that I can access it but it will change every 60 seconds I can also add different guests so I can give specific passwords and link those passwords with specific people